this video is how to get your embroidery design to show up on your screen and to begin to embroider. So the first step is to take your USB stick, put it in the top hole on the side of the machine. This is the stick that came with my Husqvarna machine. And I have already installed the embroidery arm and the Q foot. So the next thing I'm going to do is let this, the machine know that I now have the embroidery arm installed. So I'm gonna use my stylus here and I'm going to change the mode up here. So if I click on that, I'm telling it to go to embroidery. It'll say remove hoop, clear embroidery arm for calibration, calibrate unit and attach sensor Q foot. As I said, already said, the foot is attached, the unit is attached. So I just click okay and it will begin to calibrate. It means the embroidery arm will move. There you go, into position. So now I have a blank screen here. So how do I get my design? I'm gonna go up here under files and I'm gonna click on that. So it says my files and then you have a bunch of different options here. So at the bottom, this little funny symbol is the universal symbol for the internet or the USB. And if you touch it, you get the USB stick to come up. We'll touch it again. Sometimes it takes a minute. Oh yeah, and then click file. That means open. So you're essentially telling it to open the USB by clicking this open file over here. It'll bring up everything that's on my um, USB stick. So I'm looking for a Christmas design, so I'm just going to open that and push file again. And then these are the designs that I have. Um, that's not the one I'm looking for with that. Let's see what this one is. Usually after you select it, it will show you the picture. It takes a little while for the pictures to load. Um, it's rather slow. So that's another butterfly. Not very Christmassy. Somewhere in here I have some Christmas designs. Try that one. Okay, well, let's just say that this is the one I'm looking for. So once you select it, then you go down here and push OK. It's thinking. And it brings the design up onto the embroidery screen. How can you tell that this is the embroidery screen? You have this outside marking here showing you that this is the field inside the hoop. So from here, we choose the hoop and normally I have a, a book of um, all my different designs. I just look up which size hoop it takes, but the each design is calibrated for a different size hoop. So in this case, it is selecting the larger hoop that's 240 by 150. You can change the hoop designs by clicking on it or the hoop size and you have other ones to choose from, but most of the time the machine is smart and it brings up the correct size hoop for you. So that's really not usually an issue. And then um, you're pretty much ready to go. Just check the design, make sure it's in the right place. You want it inside this marked edge, marked frame on here where the hoop is. And if it is, then you just push go and um, you can put attach your hoop and you're all set to go.